My name is Jordan Schwartz, comedian, documentarian, and social media private investigator. But now, my entire legacy has been taken from me. Because as of this week, I, Jordan Schwartz, have been canceled. I'd been pushing the edge with my content lately, and I'd been seeing a massive boost from it. My Instagram following had nearly doubled, from 22 followers to 30. And one of my Reddit posts had gotten over five upvotes. And everyone at school knew my made up meme words and catchphrases. I was, frankly, an innovator. Principal Harris is so sloopy, right? Yo, that shirt is chromio. Man, I'm feeling really borp today, you know? You feeling borp today? <laughs> yeah. Yo, uh, Jordan, you got the answers to the history cover? Gorkus! Gorkus! Horbo! Dude, that is so foam board. Sorry, it's super foam board, right? It's foam board. It's a meme. It's just a meme. It's not a big deal. And then came the incident. Dude, Rachel, those shoes are so floofer. Wait, what did you just say? Floofer, your shoes are floofer. It's a meme I created, not a big deal. Oh my God, you can't say that. That's so offensive. Uh, <laughs> it's not offensive, it's just a joke. Relax, guys. Yo, Jordan just called Rachel a floofer. It's, floofer is a meme. It's, guys, it's just a meme. Look, Jordan, if you apologize to me right now in front of everyone, then I'll forgive you. Uh. No! No, I will not apologize! I'll never apologize for being who I am! Okay, fine. Then you're canceled. What? What? Okay. Yeah, I'm canceled. All right. What, everyone's just gonna ignore me now? <laughs> Guys, come on, I'm not canceled, right? Okay. Guys, come on. Stop. I'm not, I'm not can- I'm no, God. Oh my God. Steven? Steve. Steven? Guys? I really have been canceled. No! So gorgeous. <sighs> I had been deplatformed for doing what I love and creating art. Just as I was building my brand to new heights, it was all taken away from me. Even the teachers had canceled me. And who can tell me the name of Genghis Khan's mother? Anyone? No one? Anyone? Mr. Grotch, I know the answer. Not a single person here. Worst of all, I was stripped of my student council membership right before we got to publicly petition for changes in school policy. Everything was taken from me. I'm a victim. Probably the, the, the greatest victim of all time, probably. But then, one day during lunch, I discovered something fascinating. I wasn't the first student at Blandview High School who had been canceled. I gotta know what the date's gonna be like, right? That's your right. Mm. So, you got canceled too, huh? Yeah. Welcome to the club. I'm Neil. I was literally the nicest guy in school to all the girls, but whenever I asked them out, they would call me a creep or a stalker. And one day they all banded together and canceled me. Hi, I'm Ben. I like to play devil's advocate, but apparently that's not cool to do in history class anymore. So I got canceled. And I'm Cindy. The government keeps trying to poison me, but I refuse to let them. But then I got canceled when our brainwashed school nurse said I could cause another smallpox outbreak. How about you? I said a really, like, super funny joke, and everyone got all weirdly offended and canceled me. <sighs> Insane. You poor thing. I know, right? That sounds like a clear attack on your free speech. I know, right? Listen, what you need to do is you need to stand up to these people. Yeah. Nobody should tell me what to do with my body. These people had done nothing wrong. Society had abandoned them for being genuine, honest, and passionate. I have to do something. Their voices need to be heard. All I have to do is give them a platform. And I know just how to do it. And that is why we should make more ramps to allow easier access for those with disabilities. Thank you, Philip. That was something. Uh, up next, we have a petition by Colin. Uh, Hold up! 
Okay, Jordan, I can't just allow you to do I this. I don't care, Mr. Grotch. I will not abide by the unfair standards and rules of this school anymore. I am taking over this platform whether you like it or not. Fine, I would argue with this, but I just don't care anymore. Students of Blandview High School, my name is Jordan Schwartz, but you already knew that. A week ago, I was canceled for being who I am, a dank meme lord who makes hilarious catchwords and phrases, some of which you decided to be offended by. Well now, I'm here representing those who've been canceled as well for being simply who they are. We are by far the most stigmatized, discriminated against minority in this school, and dare I say, the whole world. Well now, I'm giving them their voices back. My name is Neil Simmons, and I was canceled for being too nice to girls. I would compliment them, help them with their homework, hold the door open for them, yet none of them would date me because those stupid b don't know what's good for them, and they only want to date chads. Hi, I'm Ben Loggins, and I got canceled because I like to play devil's advocate. Was the US's use of slavery bad? Yes. But did it also build the Washington Monument? Yes. Healthy debate is dead in this country! Hi, my name is Cindy Jacobs, and I got canceled because I refused to let the government taint my body with vaccinations, which will only make me gay and autistic oh, and vegan. saying was offensive and wrong. I think we all know that. <laughs> Good thing I stopped them. I did, I did a great thing, I think we can all agree. And I think we can also agree that I should be forgiven for calling Rachel a foofer now, so. Jesus Christ, Jordan, foofer isn't a bad word. What? We were sick of your shit, so we just use it as an excuse to ignore you. You're literally the most annoying kid in school, and that says a lot, considering I talk like this. So, I'm not, I'm not canceled? Jordan, you just gave the most offensive kids in school a chance to berate the student body with their hateful beliefs. Uh, yeah, uh, but I stopped, I stopped them. With Philip's crutch. Yeah, uh, asshole. You're canceled forever, dude. Boy. This day couldn't get any worse. <laughs> Jordan, you're expelled. Oh! Yes! Hey, thank you! Thank you oh, well, now this day couldn't get any worse. <laughs> Hi, my name is Mr. Jimmies, and I am a comedy talent scout. And I am going school to school across America to look for our next great comedian. And I just want to say, that I am going to do everything in my power to make sure that this man has no career ever yeah. for the rest of my life till the day yeah. that I die. Thank God. Well, that was a total foofer. Shampoo. Shampoo! Shampoo! Yo, this is so bo- bo- Bogus. Bogus. That was, that meme wasn't good. That wasn't a good meme. That's okay. Not all of them are gonna be hits. Until the day that I die, past that, I will haunt you, and my children will stomp your career down. Their children will stomp your career down. You will never succeed in comedy. You will never make it anywhere. You have no career, not even in the middle of America, not even casino comedian tours, not even with the blue comedy collar tour. None of that. Blue collar and the blue comedy. Thank you for watching my harrowing tale. Now, I'm sure you definitely wanna see where I got my comedic beginnings and my adventures as a social media private investigator. You'll find those documentaries that I have made right here on the screen. And make sure to comment down below what avenues I should pursue next. Maybe I'm a producer or a captain or a juggler. 
I, Jordan Schwartz, am capable of anything, so long as I set my mind to it. See you next time. Gork Gorkus.